The Snippets API simplifies adding custom functionality to Square online sites. Snippets are scripts that can run as various site components like pop-ups, reviews, or chatbots. There are three ways to work with Snippets API, adding, retrieving, and deleting a snippet. To start integrating Snippets API, let's begin by navigating to the API Explorer to retrieve your site ID using the Sites API. Note that Square Online does not have a sandbox environment to test calls to the Sites API, so make sure this is set to production. Now set your API to Sites and the list Sites Endpoint. Set your access token and run the request. Save the site ID returned. Now that you have the site ID, let's start working with the Snippets API. Set the API to Snippets and then Upsert Snippet, and then paste in the site ID. To keep things simple for testing purposes, let's render an alert that says, hello world, every time someone visits your site. We will just create a script element in the content field that alerts hello world. Now let's run it. Open the site you're testing and refresh the page. Okay, awesome, it's working. Now let's look at a more advanced example of how you can use the Snippets API. I'm going to play around with an open source JavaScript modal plugin called Tingle.js. We can see at the top, I'm remotely loading in the Tingle.js library and CSS stylings. Then we're configuring our modal using the Tingle.js library that we loaded above. Now back in the Explorer, I'll paste the entire modal script into the content field like so. Now let's run it. Let's head back to the site again and refresh the page. Awesome, the new modal is live. In this video, we've gone over how to find your site ID and how to upsert a snippet to a Square Online site. If you have any further questions, let us know in the comments. Happy coding!